<laughs> what are you gonna write? Uh, something self-serving. How about raise money for Xander's film opus? <laughs> Learn how to crumb. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, serves him right for having goals. There's the house in the street. That's the house that they live in And all the people they invite over are Self-made millionaires I'm gonna carry you in the day Just like I carried you at night 9.28 a.m. Took a walk today It's amazing we in America are surrounded by chemicals. Don't we realize what we're putting into our bodies? And into the earth, and into the air, and into the birds. Doesn't anyone understand? And that is why I'm off chemicals. Not again. What set you off? You thought you were just washing your hands with water and soap. Think again. Try sodium C14 olefin sulfonate, tetrasodium EDTA, polyquaternium 7. They didn't even use watermelons for the scent. And that is why I cannot touch or eat anything made out of or with chemicals. Oh, I need a new project. Oh, God. I really look great in this photo. Maybe it should be a documentary about an asshole who never helps clean the apartment. I told you, I'll clean up after I'm done laying down. Lying down. Laying. Lying. 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 Lying down. Lying down. Lying down. Lying. 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 Did one of you guys write Xander rules all mortal men on one of my life lists? After I'm done laying down. Life lists, are you serious? Yes. Certainly wasn't me. I write everything I have to do in life down on lists and then I scratch them off when they're done. Once I'm in the zone, if I see something written down on one of my lists, I don't even think about it. I just definitely, definitely do it. I have seven to 12 active lists going at any given time, so I write the same things down a lot, which requires a lot of cross-referencing, which is why, guys, if you see pieces of paper with stuff written all over them, those are my lists, so it'd be great if you wouldn't touch them or move them. Someone look and, and see how perfect the staples are. Okay. God, could one of you at least Windex the TV or something? Still laying down, Jen. Headshot Windex. Windex? Last time you refused to touch plastic and I had to read the menu to you everywhere we went. I am not gonna go that far. I just wanna keep chemicals out of my body. That's it. What? Chemicals. Courtney, send one of those over here. I need an actor for my opus. Uh, can I be in it? Well, that's why I want you to send one of them over here. I'll totally bring you in for an appointment. Uh, well, should I address that to asshole or bite me? You can just hand it to me. You feel like a failure, but you don't know how. Lysol. You're talking Windex. to saviors and the town. Common. Why hard? Four oh nine. Dope. Stars that come out and make you feel so small, and the people they fight and make you feel so oh, why high? Oh, it's like we discussed. You eat only chemicals till you get sick and throw up. What if I don't get sick? We have a plan B. Did you purchase the syrup of Ipecac like I asked? Yeah, but they didn't have any from Ipecac, so I have to make do with Vermont. 
There's no plan B. Not unless he brought waffles. Aunt Jemima. Well, you know I did. Quit horsing around, people. Let's get to work. It's been forever since I ate. But if not eating is the price I have to pay for good, natural, holistic health, then so be it. Why do I have to get sick? Did you see Super Size Me? No. He gets sick in that. So? So he made a lot of money with that movie, and I want money too, don't you? Yeah, but I want to come off looking good. Come on, Courtney. You're beautiful. Beautiful people never look bad. I know, but throwing up is different. No, it isn't. When you're beautiful, you can do whatever you want. Looking bad is for ugly people. Trust me. OK. Let's go. Make sure you get a close-up of that shit in her teeth. Everything you touch becomes a movement. We always think about the chemicals in our food, but I've realized that's not enough. We need to think about the chemicals around our food. About living in a world such as this one. Out on the salt flats of you. Worcester living through chemistry, day three. How do you feel, Courtney? I feel good. <laughs> Not sick? Uh, no, I feel really healthy and energized. God, you don't realize how much time you waste digesting food until you start consuming perfect proteins. <laughs> okay, cut. I told you to lie. Papa Xander, I really do feel good. That's it. I'm pulling you off liquids. What? It dilutes the chemicals, and I want to get this done. Just stick to eating powders from now on. But you have to let me mix it with water. No. Eat. And more. Good. Xander, are you sure this is going to be a hit? I've totally been talking it up all over. Yeah. OK, yeah. You just got the idea this morning. Courtney, you don't need to have an idea to talk something up. Just be like, I'm working on a film right now. Oh yeah? What's it about? It's still a little early to talk about it. Sounds exciting. It is. It's really exciting. I can't wait for it to be done or whatever. So there's buzz, huh? There's totally buzz. That bagel looks good. Want some? <laughs> no. Food coloring. Um, I don't think so. No, in the paper it came in. I still don't think this. Trust me. So Jed and Xander wrote in your list. You're gonna spaz? Nope, no point. I can take a little ribbing by the guys. Just have to get on with my list. It's still not cool for them to make fun of you for having goals. Jed's better than that. It was Xander too. Jed's better than that. I can't help it. Just how I'm wired, you know? Totally. Just my brain chemistry. What? Brain? Chemicals? I'm off chemicals. Yeah, coffee has caffeine, you know. Not decaf. Well, you're right, it has trichloroethylene and ethyl acetate. Went to Jed's. Must get cookware. I need some glass cookware. You got any? Yes, Frank. 
No. Don't jerk me around. I'm starving and shaky. It's only been like half a day. I eat very regularly, so when I don't eat for a few hours, it's the same as when a normal person doesn't eat for a week. I thought those looked like flies on your lips. Not funny. I seriously need to make some food. Why do you need glass cookware? All I have is metal. So? The fire will release chemicals from the metal into my food. Do you know that for a fact? <laughs> I can't cite any references, if that's what you mean. This is the plastic all over again. Fire gives off chemicals in metal, Jed! In spring, the amount of stress you're dedicating to this is gonna damage you far greater than chemicals will. Chemicals pervade every aspect of our society. So? Cancer rates are on the rise. Why do you think that is? There are a lot of factors that contribute to that. Maybe, but everything we use is made of chemicals. Do the math. Wait, cancer rates are not on the rise, and treatment is better than ever before. Most food is made by machines and delivered sealed in plastic. The American medical community is meeting the challenge head on. Well, the rest of us exacerbate it in our daily lives. Use the damn pot! Don't tell me what to do! <laughs> Professor Faulkner built a great machine It was fast and super clean Then I hung out with Jed Twice Courtney has been eating only chemicals now for seven days <laughs> And as you can see, it's ravaged her health and her beauty. What kind of society sells noxious poison and bills it as food? A society in need of reevaluation. A society that values the dollar over the health of its customers. A society of chemicals, sickness, and ugliness. Say it one more time and I will break your fucking head! That was the best! Fill it in with some B-roll and some animated statistics and Super Size uh, Me has nothing on us. Oh, uh, Sander. You lied to me. You said I'd look good. That's what a good director does, Courtney, when he needs an important shot. Hey, guys, hold on a second. R-E-C means record, right? Yes. Yes. So I have to push this button to make it record. Okay, I get it. I totally get it now. I'm sorry. I, I wish I had known about this a lot earlier. Um, can we start all over again? Do it from the beginning? Action. Oh, wait. Action. You guys seen Xander? Not here yet. Oh. Hey, Spring. I think that beer is made of inorganic hops and barley. Oh, yeah. Probably. Well? I'm not so preoccupied with that anymore. I think I was just tense. Oh, what'd you do? Exercise? Yeah, we exercised. We? Me. I was thinking of myself in the third person. Right, right, right. In addition to the first. I see. We're doing that now, too. We totally exercised. Hot and heavy. Yeah, that's irritating. I ought to go. It went, uh... There he is. Fantastic. The financier is waiting. What? The who? The financier for your film opus. He wants to see the dailies. Where did he come from? Uh, through business contacts, mostly. But he's got to see something today or he's going to split. You raised money for my film? Yeah, I had to. It was on my list. <laughs> Let's see what you got. Uh. Late night walk. It's uh, an experimental, uh, documental, experimentary. For future humans who communicate telepathically and have no uh, gender. Do something. You've got the sculptor's hands. You've got those lonely eyes.
So Xander got to one of your lists. What does it say? Refill estrogen prescription. Oh, just never mind about that. 